My name's Margaret Lilly and I'm part of Scripture Union. You know, I used to think how busy my days were. I'd be bombing around the country in the southwest, uh, visiting uh, children's and youth workers, staff, and uh, arranging all sorts of events. And uh, I used to say no two days of my working life was the same. And yet here we are. Our days are very similar. My day today was very similar to yesterday. I seem to spend a lot of my time on screen, six or even seven hours on screen in meetings or videoing things uh, for the supporting you videos, these videos and so forth. And uh, yeah, it's just changed. And yet we know that um, as lockdown gradually um, opens up, uh, things will change and we will be able to get back to meeting the children and um, youth out on the streets, out in the parks, doing holiday clubs and, and missions. But maybe things might just be a little bit different in the next few months to come. And I don't know about the coping mechanisms perhaps you found, uh, but on screen time, sometimes I just find it really difficult to keep my attention. And uh, I found the joy of, of this little book. And uh, it's a colouring little book. And, uh, do you know, I've never really been into colouring. And yet, I've found it really good. Maybe because of my mental health or, or something like that. Having to concentrate on something a little bit else while someone's actually speaking. But I've really enjoyed just getting some felt tips or pencils and start colouring. And it's really been helpful for me to help concentration. And, you know, I would never have done that in, in the days before uh, the lockdown. Um, and even our conversations. Who would have thought we would have started wearing masks or uh, choosing which, one, which masks might we wear um, today uh, to the supermarket and things? Who would have thought those would have been entering in even to our conversations or into our heads? Who would have thought I would have picked up um, things like this to colour? But you know, one of the things that I would have picked up every day, and I still do, is my Bible. And the verse that really speaks to me through this lock time, time is where Jesus says at the end of his time with the disciples is that I will never leave you until the end of the age. And this age we're in, he hasn't left us and he won't leave us. And so every day might feel the same to me. I miss not going out. I miss driving. I miss the beach. I miss going down to see people uh, physically. I know I can see them on screen. And yet I know that actually God is with me. God is with me. He promised that. And he's not going to let me down. He's going to be with me and is with me. So those times when I get frustrated and I don't want to do another day like today, I know that I am in his hands. I know that he cares for me and he loves me so much and he understands. So sometimes I feel like shouting. I feel like whispering. I feel like I don't know what. And yet God knows me and he's never left me. So in our days, Let's keep hold of the promise that in the age to come, whenever that might be, when lockdown is completely finished, that God still remains faithful and is with us. Mm -hmm.